So this is the final observations for the iodine lab, uh, the diffusion lab. Um, and what you can see here is this is, this is uh, our tube that has been sitting um, in our beaker for 30 minutes. And we're going to be looking at each individual part. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is Mr. Natoni here is going to take a glucose test strip and dip it into the um, solution in the beaker. Okay. Okay. So glucose test strips are yellow when you first get them out of the bag. And what the indicator tells you is that if it turns green, that means there's glucose in the solution. So I'm going to dip this in, and it is green. So that means glucose has left the bag. Okay. All right, and then the, the last thing we're going to look at um, is the beaker solution itself and the tube solution. And you can kind of see... The beaker has remained kind of that yellowy color, and the, the tube inside is a dark blue. And remember, if starch comes in contact with iodine, it turns a dark blue. So what this means is that the iodine has moved into the tube, but the starch did not move out of the dialysis tubing. And because... And because our test strip turned green, that means that the glucose has also left the tube and gone into the beaker. Okay, so that's the final observation. So fill out your data table and fill out the rest of the uh, analysis questions.